Welcome back to Living 808 into Hawaii's Kitchen at Chef Zone, a division of Waihata. It's the big red building just off Nimitz. And today it's our pleasure to have Miro Kaimiki in the house. And that means chef de cuisine Trevor Webb is with us, as well as director of business development Karen Kuniyuki. Thank you guys for being with us. Appreciate it. Thanks for having Thank us. You. Hey, I want to know a little bit about, for our viewers, uh, a little bit more about the restaurant. Can you tell me about Miro Kaimiki? Um, well, Miro Kamiki was originally Cafe Miro. It was a staple in Kamiki for about 25 years. It was run by owner chef Shigeru Kobayashi. It was known for its affordable French cuisine. Chef Chris Kajioka was then given the opportunity to take over the restaurant and the space and wanted to keep the integrity of what it was for Kamiki and make it attainable for the community. So you guys are participating in the Chef Zone's Da Chef's Box. Um, can you tell me a little bit about Da Chef's Box and for our viewers that really don't know anything about it? Well, the Chef Box is a box that comes with chef-prepared meals featuring fresh and healthy ingredients that uh, the customers can enjoy from the safety of their own home. Can you tell me the experience you guys have uh, you've had in participating in this program, the Chef's Box? Yeah, it's been a really fun experience. Um, chef Peel is Chef uh, Jason Peel. He's our corporate chef. Chef Chris Kajioka and, and Chef Trevor Webb have been kind of collaborating their travels and their comfort food and wanted to really have this menu kind of be exemplary of that. And so it's been a really fun experience for them to create these menus and share it with the community. Perfect. What, what types of foods then since you said French cuisine, are we expecting to see a little French taste in the box? Uh, there will be a few, I guess, little French components into it, but it's mostly going to be food that we enjoy eating, comfort food, uh, something we'd like to share with friends and family. What would the specialty be of Miro Kaimiki? I wouldn't say we have one specialty, but uh, we're really focusing on using uh, local farmers, local produce, uh, and trying to incorporate that um, vegetable forward thinking into our food. Kind of a challenge, but we're, we've been finding uh, some great farmers that we love to work with, and uh, you know things are working out for us, and hopefully uh, they'll start growing a, a few new experimental crops that we've been talking about, and uh, we'll feed Hawaii with that. You know? Perfect. Well, I can't wait for you to feed me. We're going to find out when we come back uh, what's in the chef's box from Miro Kaimiki. We'll be back with more in Hawaii's Kitchen. Good fun. I've, uh, as many viewers know, I've already tried the, uh, the chef's box a couple of times. It is fabulous, easy. Tanya's going to be doing it next. Oh, but did I get you finally? It's yes, finally yes, my yes. I'm excited too. You know, I have had takeout from Miro Kaimuki. It's mm -hmm. amazing. And, you know, they've just done such a good job. Everyone had to pivot to do that. So it really lends itself to this whole chef box concept and being able to do things at home too. And it's so great to have so many different restaurants joining um, the Chef Zone and doing this for us. And we can order it and take it home and have all these great meals from it. Yeah, they make it super easy. And in this particular box, you'll see in just uh, a little bit later in the show, very, very good food and super easy too. So, um, that would be yeah. me and he'd be easier. It's not. <laughs>